Uh, not finding my true love. Oh, I'm right here, babe. Aww. There we are. I'll find you. No, no, no. <laughs> like, true, true love. You know, um, so true as Right. Whoa. <laughs> Avi and I wrote this with CJ Barron and Talay Riley. Yeah. And we wrote it in probably an hour. Yeah. Really? I feel like the funny yeah. thing yeah. That... It. it was wow. super, super quick. It was so fast. I think the most real banter has become me and Scott. Yeah. I, I think so. <laughs> yeah. No, have have fists been thrown? No. No, no, no. 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 No, Avi would be too scared for that. Who's like the, who's like the meat? <laughs> uh oh, as, as a fist is thrown in this interview. Avi, 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 fucking scary. Hey, Avi, 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 Avi. Scott is making me smile today. Oh. He's being really funny. Oh. <laughs> I am laughing a lot. This is entirely disgusting. I am also tired. <laughs> This town ain't big enough for the both of us. One, two, three. When there's something strange in your neighborhood, who you gonna call? Ghostbusters! When there's something strange and it don't look good. Who you gonna call? Who you gonna call? Who you gonna call? You gonna call the ghost ghostbusters? Whoa, 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 whoa! Who you gonna call? Who you gonna call? Pentatonics. No, no, no. But we actually had like an argument about at the beginning. Kevin does this Darth Vader noise. And I was like, I'm pretty sure it's, and he was like, no, I know Star Wars. It is. And I was like, okay. And then I checked a tutorial on YouTube, and sure enough, he was right. Yeah, of course you did. So you don't want to battle um, obvious Star Wars. You knowledge. had a Darth Vader sound effect argument. Yeah. That was adorable. Yeah. How pitch perfect that is, is that? our life every day. How long this is supposed to go? But here I am. Ask me some questions. I'll do my best. Let's see. Hello, hello. Don't exist. Stop, seriously, you wanna fight me? I'll fight you outside. <laughs> They're not real. Yeah, that song is so special. And when we wrote it, we heard Avi's voice on it because um, Avi can capture emotion really well, especially in a ballad. And so um, I remember we were talking about it, and Avi goes, But you, didn't you write it? Wasn't it inspired by your nephew? Don't you wanna sing it? And I was like, No, I like hear your voice on it. I really want you to sing it. And it's just a, such a great closer to the album. Yeah, when, when they asked me to sing it, I was like, really honored like I was like really touched about it but I was also like oh man I don't want to take this away from Scott like what a beautiful moment but um like when I sang about it I was like thinking about it to myself I was like I want to be able to sing this to my kids someday you know it's, just, it's honestly just such a beautiful song and I was just so honored to be able to sing it and there he is Scott what a baller looking beautiful as usual Hi. Valentine does Not always feel like I feel like Valentine kind of feels forced. Yeah. Wait, I'm gonna make a little list of stuff we like, should try to do. Yeah, definitely. I would say if I were to have like a perfect set, I would say we would have maybe three chill songs. But in this set, we have like four or five. So we're headed back to the hotel. Scott and I are talking a little bit about the show. We really think it's time to start tweaking it and figuring out exactly what this show needs to be. Daft Punk, is that a good opener? <laughs> um, well, <laughs> too much choreo. Yes, they? I agree. There's too much choreo. Yeah, I'm yeah. out of breath. Yeah. I think we can keep most of the choreography. There's little things I want to take out. This telephone's fine. Yeah, yeah, telephone's cool, and that's awesome. Transition into a uh, into video, into video is really cool. That's cool. And then uh, drunken love is all. That's Beyonce awesome. is always really good. Yeah, yeah. And then what, what's the rap for Beyonce? I need your love. Uh, no, oh, love, love again. again. That comes down right there. It's sad. Yeah, I don't, I don't I like that it comes down there. I think we should. I think if anything, we just did like I need, I need your love. Right there could be fine. Um, or love again comes later. It might be or love again maybe comes later. You know what we could do instead of love again? Huh. Oh, I hate that I'm saying this right now, but ET. But maybe down a half step. I did it again, so I'm a Let the baby. Drop. I can do Avi. I can just do Avi. Do Avi. Do Avi. Please do me. Please do me. Ding 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 ding. ding. <laughs> do. Because every day he checks how low he can go, so he gets the note. Yeah. The you gotta know where you're at. Always grinding. You just gotta know where you're at. Always grinding, always just working. Just in case. <laughs> you gotta sing a low note, you gotta know what you have. I get it. I <laughs> get that. You I just get it. Is it a B flat? Is it an A? Yeah, yeah you just never know. It, cha it changes on the daily. It changes every day. Oh, no. Between B and 
Between two. me and Abby. Oh, yeah. We flirt with each other. So while he gets all set up, I'm gonna talk about this sexy bass man over here. So, Abby, we met through a mutual friend. And it's a funny story. Um, we just went and got coffee one day. Just got coffee. And I knew he was gonna be in the group the second he introduced himself to me because he literally was like, I am Abby. <laughs> Like, just telling the group that. But now he's an amazing musician. And